Our next bout here, a three-round catch weight with Roberto Young and Jimmy Scully. Four and a half inch straight of reach for Young. 5'11 to 5'10 and four years older is Young as we get set for this one here. Mike Corey and Jail Sonnen. Now look at, what do you look at between these two with Scully out of Phoenix, Arizona here, the hometown product, and Roberto Young fights out of Phoenix from Glendale. Thoughts with these two? I'm very familiar with both of these guys. I've seen them both fight before. I think they're very scrappy guys. They're similar in age, they're similar in height. They're the exact same weight. Their reach advantage isn't enough of a discrepancy to be talked about. I think that they had uh, a pretty intense moment at the, at the weigh-in yesterday. They both had good support, but sometimes that support can lead to pressure. Let's see which one of them can keep their emotions intact to prevail tonight. All right, so here we go. Young in the black shorts and Skelly in the red shorts as we get set for this one in this three-round catchweight match. And how about Young, who is on a little bit of a losing streak here, Chael, after winning his first two. We saw him back at World Series of Fighting 23. Yeah, y Young is a, a, a very tough guy. Don't let those losses be deceptive at all. I thought his performances were very good, but sometimes you come up a little bit short. Now, how fitting of a name is Scully for Mr. Scully? Here? It's almost like a nickname. He just charged across the ring. That was not the best shot I've ever seen, but I'll tell you, that was very effective. He kept those feet moving, closed the distance. Young scrambled up. Well, we got a, quite a pace going here. Look at this. As you said, probably not as technically sound as you would have liked with Scully going right after Young that time. Both guys are going to need a second here, Mike. You're seeing guys, uh, they're kind of both taking a beat or two. That was a very, very high-paced exchange. Scully with a leg kick. Looked like Young was going to go for a takedown. And now here we are right in front of each other. Scully, again, a little bit wild. He's not quite as crisp as you might like to see. It's fairly effective. Young puts him down. There's a little bit because of the shot, a lot of it because of the loss of footing here. I think Scully is OK. Scully's looking to wrap up a leg. Uh, no, now he's looking to cover. Young's got to finish. Oh, stop it. Wow. Roberto Young unleashing on Scully, and they stop the fight. Normally, it's Scully who gets out of it early, and this time it was Young rebounding from three straight losses to knock off Scully. That was a crazy minute right there. There was a lot of things that just happened in front of us right there. There was a few moving parts. Look, Scully comes across the ring with a terrible tackle, but it was effective because he wanted it so bad. He kept his feet moving. Young works his way off the bottom. Scully gets dropped. Looks like he's going for a leg lock, and Young slips a couple of punches through. Referee with a stoppage, which I thought was a little bit early, but I've changed my opinion of it now because Scully is certainly not agreed. In fact, Scully is still not up even to his stool. So that was a very good stoppage by a referee. I just didn't have the vantage point. That was an incredible one minute fight. Well, let's go back to the beginning. It was Scully that kind of went after Young initially. What did you see here? Then how of a sudden all Okay, watch this, Mike. This, this is not a great shot right here. Scully's about to change elevation and just start running his feet. He's way, way too far out. It's coming in just a moment here, but you're going to see he just he just flat out wanted this. Look at that. He just runs him and runs him and runs him until he hits the, the fence and there's nowhere else to go. Young says, look, I don't want to be in this position. He starts working himself out. Very tiring right there. Looked like Holly Holm escaping Ronda Rousey last weekend. <laughs> now here we are on their feet. Both these guys try to catch their breath. And then Young decides to get a little something going. Right here, they're both realizing the pace they just put on each other. It was such a quick reversal by Young, and now picking his spots, and here's where it all started. Even here where Scully went down, Young did throw a, a good right hand, but I thought that Scully was a little bit off balance. I thought that's part of what took him down. Scully looked like he was going for a leg lock, and Young just came with some punches right there. I thought perhaps it was an early stoppage, which you can see right there by Scully's face. It sure wasn't. Our referee, the best vantage point in the house, makes another excellent call. We always have the top officials here at World Series of Fighting. And this one's over, my friend. Let's go inside the cage to Jazz Securo. He has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Ryan Brueggemann steps in and stops the fight at 1 minute 11 seconds of round number one. Officially a TKO due to strikes. Your winner, Roberto Ali Young.